bacon. Does that get your attention? It works around here with the staff, and we're cooking oh, with it this morning. It smells so good. This is Chef Brian Moran. He is a culinary arts instructor, and he works with Patrick Cudahy, too. Good morning. Good morning. So we're cooking with bacon. We're cooking with bacon the today. The possibilities are endless, the right? The possibilities are endless. We, we're working with uh, Patrick Cudahy Meats, 125 years of tradition like the Green Bay Packers. We uh, are incorporating ideas and recipes for Super Bowl coming up mm -hmm. and all these parties that we have on weekends for football. Unfortunately, the Packers aren't there, but we're still going to be making all these beautiful recipes. All right. Two Patrick great ideas for you this segment, and he'll be back in an hour with some more. So what are we going to do first? We want to do the sandwich first? Yeah, let's do the sandwich okay. first. We have a little mini appetizer sandwich. We have a little butter top roll. All right. And we, some of the ingredients we've assembled today is we have some of our bacon that's uh, heating it up and sizzling up. We have some Patrick Cudahy um, smoked uh, ham. Okay. And we have just a little uh, butter top roll, and uh, we're going to put some spicy relish. Well, you do that. Yeah, you take get a bite that ready. out of that see if I... We take this recipe by using, you can either use a jardinier uh, type of spicy relish or just a spicy pickle relish and put some of the pickle relish on the bun first. Yeah, I like that better than just a slab of pickle. Yeah, it's just a little bit different. It just kicks this up a little bit. Okay. And then we add a little bit of these nice thick layers of the Patrick Cudahy uh, ham first. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to take a little bit of the bacon and I'm just going to squeeze in. Um, we get this glazed mm -hmm. with a little bit of um, sweet uh, maple syrup and a little brown sugar. It gives this nice little... Already um, done for you, or do you have to do that no, one? We, we dress that on the, on the bacon. So when you're heating up and cooking the bacon, we sprinkle a little bit of that um, just as the bacon finishes and cooks. It gives us a sweet little finish along with I the... I like that. Uh, yeah. Okay. Along with the bacon. And then we add a little spicy dressing of uh, mayo and mustard. Because there's not enough flavor yet. No, you got to have a little mayo with our wonderful Patrick Cudahy bacon. And you Di put Dijon in there and too, And a little right? Dijon okay. in there, right. And I we like top that. that off and we have this lovely little sandwich. Really nice. Don't yeah. just put ham on a bun. Do it this way and your guests will love it. Now also you could do the kebabs. Right, we have a little uh, bacon kebab. It's got um, bacon that we um, par cook and we cook the bacon just a little bit enough to make it pliable. Okay. So we'll, uh, take you don't the, want it too crispy. No, and then so that you can fold it. All right. And then we have these nice big heavy duty um, toothpicks. toothpicks, right? Yes. Yeah, they're they're. And you start with a sizable. bacon, and we do layers of uh, pineapple. And I like to uh, grill the uh, kebab uh, pieces. Right on the same pan here. Yeah, yeah. you can Green do that. Green pepper and some. Should I turn those at all? Pineapple, sure. You can turn those pieces of pineapple. We use a little bit of red onion, and then we'll keep Ooh, adding look at layers. That. Yeah, you get this nice color browning. And like then we, we add, Rachel, we add a teeny bit of this little glaze to it. It's really delicious. Oh, it's a right combination of a little bit of uh, soy sauce and orange juice and fresh ginger. Okay. It gives all this nice flavor. So we get this beautiful assembly and we got these beautiful little kebabs. And then they're done. So all the work goes on in the yeah, pan. Yeah, exactly. Assemble, Assemble and it's done. And then you can make these up ahead of time if you want. Okay. Chill them down and heat them up. You can go to the Patrick Cudahy Meats Facebook page. Yeah, because you're doing a whole doing a huge year long thing, is that right? 125 different things great about Wisconsin and Patrick Cudahy Meats and all their bacon and ideas. So today we've done the little bacon kebab and the little mini sandwich. Yeah, this is delicious. And I'll try the kebab next. Nice smell. Isn't yeah, it? thanks, Chef. Okay, and you'll be back next hour with two more bacon recipes. Right. But again, for more, go to Facebook.com and go to Patrick Cudahy Meats for their 125-year uh, celebration. Right. And the recipe's online, fox11online.com. We'll be right back.